then got your toe news submitted by Cinna Buns. A human toe <laughs> that was used for a cocktail at a Canadian bar has been stolen. What the Ooh. fuck? Why are you using a human I toe for a cocktail? Eaten. Isn't that cannibalism? That's nasty. Because I picture the worm at the bottom of a tequila, except it's a toe. Yes. Pretty much. What? <laughs> Where did they get this dirty toe? And I don't think that's sanitary, right? And whose toe is that? Is that the bartender's What's toe? Up, Canada, what the fuck? I'm almost sure that has to be like the owner's toe. Why is there a Toe. Oh, it probably was just as a display and they weren't serving out of it. No, like people were, it's a cocktail. Wait, wait, wait. So like at the end of the drink, do they suck and eat the toe? Or like, are you supposed to give it back? So this is the, the rule. It says, drink it fast or drink it slow, but your lips must touch the toe. So this is what the cocktail looks like. That is fucking gross. It's called a sour toe. Cocktail. I've done oh. that a million times. That is a fucking huge toe! A human toe. A real human toe. But now, it's gone missing. Why? Oh my god, look at it decayed. That is fucking it, weird. Maybe somebody ate it because they're too drunk. Uh, that has happened in the past. So, uh, so they've gotten multiple toes. Where do they get all these toes from? And what kind of flavor does it bring out in this drink? I mean, absolutely. Girl, you're, girl, you're asking the weird shit. <laughs> That's like the wrong question. I don't have the answer to that. <laughs> well, no, because it's just like if they keep getting new toes. It's like, it it's must just have a, a very distinct flavor. Oh. I'm pretty sure it's not for <laughs> the flavoring. It's probably for the novelty. I would say it would add flavor, but that's Clearly, cool. this is an Asian toe. It's a little spicy. It has a little mung bean aftertaste. <laughs> like, I don't like this. Stinky tofu taste. I know, though. like, ugh. Yes. Can I get the black person's toe, please? <laughs> <laughs> Weird. So this cocktail is being served at the downtown hotel in Dawson City in Yukon. Canada, so North Canada. Yukon Gold. Yeah, and so the drink is called the Sour Toe Cocktail. So it's they're saying that toe. the tradition mm. claims it can trace its roots back to the 1920s when they claim that there was this rum runner that had his toe frostbitten and so he preserved his toe Ew. in a bottle of rum and then so he kept it in this cabin that they had up in the Yukon. So, he never reattached it, he just left it in the bottle of rum? I really don't know why. I have my wisdom teeth, so I could relate to that. 50 years later, the pickled toe was found by a Yukon native who bought the cabin. So <laughs> They forgot the toe. <laughs> yeah, like he, they left a lot of things behind, but the toe was there. And so finally, that's when that native took it to the downtown hotel and they just said, hey, why don't we just create a cocktail? And originally, the cocktail was a beer mug full of champagne. And then they, they would place a toe in there. But With toenail cool. clippings at the top. Oh. So that was short-lived because apparently there was someone that said, like, I don't care about the toe, but I can't down an entire mug full of champagne. Like, that's too Yeah. Big. Yeah, so then they ended up switching it up, and now it's just pretty much your alcohol of choice with the toe, with the in, toe? It. With the toe in it and after you're done you take the toe out and someone up and you put in someone else's drink uh yeah pretty much so they have a two hour Fucking window weird. of when they serve this drink and so um they're saying that this recent toe they had just started adding it to the drinks but there was this man that went to the hotel he asked the waitress his new waitress if they can create this cocktail for him even though it was outside of the that two hour window and so she was being nice, so she made it for him. And they also awarded him with the Sour Toe Cocktail Certificate with his name on it. But this dude, he took the toe and he left the certificate behind, so they have his name, um, but they still can't find him for whatever reason. So they're just- Why would anyone want a toe? Where do they get the human toe? Yeah, where do you get the human toe from? Well, it's been donated because they know of this, they know of this uh, cocktail, so people were like, oh, I had my toe amputated, here, you oh. can have it. Oh. Yeah. They should just change the bar to like body part bar, so you could get the bar. anus cocktail, the ball sack the cocktail. Dick cock the cock cocktail. The cock cocktail. <laughs> we should do all of those. Can we get a cocktail, please? The actual one or the drink? What would you like? Mm -hmm. <laughs> if they're donating amputated toes, like then there must be something wrong with that toe, so why would you drink something that has or it that, could be frostbitten or mm, like other things too. Well, like, they also cure it too, so it takes like about like this most recent. Like a one, rotten toe. Yeah, it, it took about six months in salt for it to be like dehydrated fully, and they can like use. Well, oh, they mummify it basically. Yeah, they do. Yeah. That's why it looks like this. Ugh. It's gross. Isn't that borderline cannibalism? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I think, so. I think it's one of those things where it's like. I dare you. Yeah, I dare I you. dare you can't do it. I do it. You want to do it? Okay, let's do it. Come on. I'm good, man. I'd be like, I, yeah, you win. Number one, I don't like hard liquor that much in the first place. 
So that on top of with a human toe in it, I'm good. I feel even like if you're this drunk? is even if I'm drunk. I mean, you know, and when I'm drunk, I still have you know my wits about me, somewhat, um. somewhat. Enough to know that I'm not gonna fucking put a human toe to my fucking face. I don't like a living toe near my fucking mouth. Back in 2013, a man accidentally swallowed. Ugh. And then he choked to death? They've gone through eight toes since they started this tradition. That tells me to quit. You know what? White people, you win. I feel like the person that started this, he was like, you know, all those Asians think they're so badass eating the chicken feet and the duck feet. We all drink toes. <laughs> I know. <laughs> they one up us hard. Yeah, we will not do that crazy shit. His name though, is like Captain Dick, by the way. Exactly. Captain Dick? It wasn't Captain Tran, Captain Lee, or Captain Kim. It was Captain, Captain Dick. Dick. <laughs> 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 Human Dick. Dang, that's so crazy. I can't even do the fucking worm. Like, that worm yeah, already. Worm? I'm like, oh, why? What kind of worm is that? Like, what's the, what's... It looks like a parasite or something. What's the catch? I don't, I know there's probably this tradition behind it, but I'm just like, no. You have to ask your ancestors. I don't know, we got like tiger ball whiskey and shit too, so we're not, we're... There's hazy. tiger balls? In yeah, it's uh, supposed to be like for Viagra. Body. Really? Yeah. I thought it was just oh. the name. No, no it's just Tiger that balls. if you drink Tiger Balls or whatever, you get your dick hard. Yeah, what? which makes no sense at all, whatsoever. Well, because they thought that any body part will make your body part better. Yeah, yeah. if you put the eyeball in it, your vision's gonna get better. Yeah. My mom always told me to eat the fish eye. That's what my mom <laughs> told me too. Maybe it made it worse. That's, yeah. That's the Chinese science right there. Chinese science makes those, they yeah. just kind You want a big dick, son? Here's Tiger Dick. Yeah, it's Don't almost like somebody was dick. like uh, bullshitting through the answer and just became a fact. Maybe you know what I mean? Yeah. How can I get a strong dick? How tight a dick? <laughs> it just became that was in history. Did you see the uh, Andrew Z's uh, food, bizarre foods of him going to that China restaurant where everything is dick? Oh, like condom salad. It was no, no. <laughs> condom salad. <laughs> no, it's a it's a restaurant. I think it's in Beijing. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything dick there is soup. dick. Yeah. Yeah. Like what animals? All that all kinds of animals. Yeah, all here. it's a dick buffet. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's a fucking. Awesome. <laughs> That's a sausage fest. Yeah. <laughs> that motherfucker has eaten so much dick, like he could tell like which dick he prefers. Yeah. He goes, you don't want some of like the, the younger dick because it's too short and too hard and rubbery. Some of the bigger ones are a lot more soft. It's like, oh God, bro. Ew. But he can't eat spam. I know, right? Or walnuts. He ate a walnut, he freaked the fuck out. <laughs> and like literally the scene before, oh, he ate a fucking dick. So yeah. Weird. We ate fucking fish cum. Oh, shirako, yeah. right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fish cum all the time. Yeah. All the time? <laughs> all the time. <laughs> cod roe or cod something. Yeah, but I don't eat it all the time. Shirako. It's delicious. Yeah. I had a funky flavor. I don't know. It's weird to me because I feel like I can totally eat like female stuff, like eggs or whatever. But then when it comes to like cum and dick, I think about it. And I'm like, does this make me gay if I enjoy the animal's <laughs> body part? Do you think it'd be different if you grew up on it though? Cause you grew up on eggs. Oh yeah, yeah, huh. I don't know, maybe. I mean- Eggs are delicious, dude. Oh. I think uni is a uh, uh, sea urchin sperm. Is it? I think it's I think it's a male body part. Oh. Well, it's it's the ambiguous part. Cause like- Cause they're not- There's no female male. Yeah. Oh, they're not? It's, it's, it's the gonads. Well, I guess it's I the ball know. sack then. It's the balls. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. Yeah, the gonads. Are they creatures of the both? I think so, yeah. Like a worm? The hermaphrodite? Yeah, hermaphrodite. <laughs> <laughs> That's the classy way of saying it. <laughs> I, I like You it. have to say it in that tone. Yeah, the hermaphrodite. Are you a hermaphrodite? There's so many creatures in the world, and they're all delicious. Except human, because you ain't down to do human I'm pretty health. sure humans taste good. Uh, uh, uh. I mean, just from like... Just scientifically speaking? Scientifically speaking, man, they, you know, stagnant, don't... We're probably like Wagyu. Oh, yeah. Don't move much, just sit Especially around. Especially you. Yeah, dude. <laughs> like straight up me, dude. I'm pretty sure, like, there's like marbled areas of my body that are absolutely amazing. David Bacon. <laughs> oh, how much would you guys pay? Sam Gip David. Sam Gip David. <laughs> I'll pay not to eat you. Really? Watch you hear it and you smell it. Like, what is this? What is this? And the Bart just serves you a piece. You just ate David. And I'm over here in the hospital. That got you, bitch. <laughs> oh. But yeah, anyway, so they're saying that they are offering a reward to anyone that has any information about the dude that took it. Fucking toe thieving they, bitch. They don't mention how much the award is, but they do mention though. So back in 2013, when the man um, swallowed the toe, they <laughs> had a $500 fine. But then because of that guy, they upped it to 2,500. So once they find this dude that stole the toe, he's gonna get fined that amount. Do they want the original toe back, or they just want a toe donor? No. So the original toe, seven years after they started this cocktail, back in 1971. So seven years after that, um, there was this miner that 
accidentally swallowed it. But this oh. this 2013 guy, he, he swallowed it on purpose. Oh. We're gonna okay. fucking swaddle toes all day. You're so drunk. People, it should be their first drink if they're gonna drink it. And you have to kiss it too? I, I saw like a video of people taking the shot and so they just kind of like open it a little bit to like drink the alcohol and then the toe touch touches the, lip. the lips and then it comes down. But, the, but yeah, back in 2013 when this dude purposely swallowed it, he was filming that whole thing and so you could see like he opened his mouth like wide. He was like... And then it just swallowed. It was like that. Cool, cool guy. <laughs> cool, bro. All the bitches. Yep. You're captain of the fraternity now, bro. I know. <laughs> yeah. That's so stupid. Gross. Cool guy. Go to hell, you toe stealing bitch. <laughs> Thanks for watching Just Kidding News, guys. Don't forget to comment down below. We want to hear what you say only if it's positive. Remember that. To watch more videos, go up here, baby. baby.